Hearing of the rebellion, Roy hurried his pace toward Ostia. According to the information that he had gathered on the way, General Legance, one of Lord Hector's advisors, had started a rebellion with Lieutenant Devious to sell to sell Ostia to burn. Luna had been captured and taken hostage by Legance. She was imprisoned inside the castle Ostia because Legance thought he could use her for something. Later on, hearing that report, Roy and company entered Ostia in an effort to rescue Lelina. Ostia, the largest and most active city in Lycia, was to become a battlefield, stained with blood. Hi everybody, welcome back to more Fire Emblem Sword of Seals. So yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of units in the next chapter. A lot of enemy units. There's an arena also. Alright, so. Let's see, I'm gonna need... Let's see, take out you, take out you, keep you. Uh, do I have a door key? Yes, I do. Okay. In that case, I'm actually before. But hang on a second. Just a second. Hang on. Uh... There we go. Anybody have anything I can steal? Or worse stealing, rather? Look for my gem. Mmm, red gem. Do I need it? Mmm. Decision is decision. I'm just going to have right now. I'm going to do it on gold. 12,000. I'm okay. Don't need it. Alright, so take out Shad, take out Shad. Uh, let me see. Do I use Sue? Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna use Sue. Let's give our bows to you. Let's take that. Another one of these. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. so, yeah, you'll be okay. The walls will be okay. Again, that's always 10. In the next chapter, we'll be getting quite a few new units. Uh, we're getting a paladin and I believe two cavaliers. Yeah, yeah, I, th I think that's it. 
So as you can see, there's a gate here. You're gonna need someone with a door key, or you can just bring Chad if you don't if you don't have either. Thankfully, there's a little there's a door open door right here you can pass through. But you but to make things easier, you definitely want to have to bring him. And also, there's treasure here too. I forgot about that. So yeah, definitely bring Chad along. You're gonna need him. So uh, and you can see there's a lot of uh, villages to visit. Make sure you try and visit them all to get all the stuff. There's a vendor here. Oh, at the shop. There's an armory also. Here's an arena here if you want to give your units a little bit of boost, a little bit more experience points. I'm probably going to end up using the arena a little bit. Just be careful though, because this time around, uh, unlike in Blazing Sword, the arena is a little more difficult to use because the foes tend to be a little stronger. And also, there's no uh, glitch with Ninian because you don't get Ninian in this game, so. So, yeah, so, what if you're playing on an emulator like me, just uh, save state it before you enter the arena. And uh, you should be just fine. So, alright, let's uh, save. And let's begin. Devious, how is the city doing? They've been quiet so far, sir, but the mercenary knights from Ilya that hiked and hired are showing no submission. Hmm, <laughs> what's wrong with them? We're telling them we'll pay more. Well, Ilya's mercenary knights are known to never betray their masters. You fool! I know that! Joe Narsh is going to arrive soon. If we don't have Ostia under our control by then, he'll laugh at us. Uh, of course, sir. We meant these Lilina to bargain with the mercenary knights. If we use her as a hostage, then they should surrender to us. But that must be a last resort. We will fight them ourselves with the help of Dragon Knights sent from Burn to crush Ilya's forces. Devious, I want you to clear out the town, the town and guard. I want you to clear out the town and guard the castle gate. I will defend the, the inside of our castle. Yes, sir. Marlonis, around how many of Ostia's troops have joined the rebellion? Quite a few, I'm afraid. They have forgotten their loyalty toward Lord Hector. And are simply flocking towards the one with more power, which is Byron. How disgraceful. I see. But there's good news too, Master Roy. There's a band of mercenary knights from Ilya that are willing to join, join forces with us and attack the rebels. Mercenary knights from Ilya? Yes. They said that they signed a contract with Lord Hector that they would fight Byron alongside Ostia's troops. That's fortunate. But when the mercenary knights hear that Lord Hector has passed away, that contract would probably be bro broken. Do you think it's possible for us to hire them into our service? I would have thought so too, Master Roy. However, they already knew about Hector's death. They offered, to offer, they offered to fight alongside us anyway. Why do they go that far when they are mercenaries? Ilya is a snowy area with harsh temperatures, so London isn't very arable. Therefore, sending out mercenaries to fight, for, to fight for pay is one of Ilya's main sources of economic input. I've also heard that mercenaries from Ilya put trust over anything else, and that they never betray their employers. Nor is that true, I see. It sh and they should be powerful allies. Yes, Fortune is still with us. Master Roy. But I heard from the mercenary knights that one of the three dragon lords is coming here, the Legion of Dragon Knights. If they should join the rebels, then our chances of defeating them would be extremely slim. Don't worry, what are you going to do? The Kingdom of Etruria might join us. Etruria? Would that be possible? General Cecilia, the Sorcerer General of Etruria, was my teacher in battle arts when I was studying in Ostia. I have a feeling that she would be willing to join forces with us. I would object, Master Roy. If we between on Etruria to solve our own matters in Lysia, we'll be sure to be their laughing stock for decades. Yes, I know that. But this is truly an important matter for Lysia. I think that we should go for the safest and most definite opinion option rather than worry about the consequences and do nothing, which would most likely lead to the extinction of Lysia. Master Roy, let me move quickly. I'll write a letter to General Cecilia. Merlinus, I need you to get the letter to her as quickly as possible. Yes, Master Roy, you are right. I shall send the letter to her as soon as you are ready. Thanks. All right, everybody, let's take let's retake Ostia. Okay, so send you over here to the village. Send you up here. Send super village. Okay, that should do it. 
looks like the Lysian Alliance have started attacking the rebels. Alright, we're going too. Let's go and drive out the rebel forces. Will do, sir. Wait, where's Noah? Um, I think he went to the arena a while ago. He said he's coaching a young girl in the sword arts. That Noah? Coach? That's unusual. Well, no matter. Once you find out that we're attacking the rebels, we'll catch up to us. Yep. Alright, all right, let's go. Alright, so those are the... Okay, so. This is Zealot, one of the new units that we're recruiting this chapter. He's a pre-promoted paladin. His stats are decent, as you can see. However, his growth rate is pretty shitty, though. So... He's a better choice for a paladin than Marcus, but not by much. And Marcus' excuse is that Marcus is old. Zealot, he's not old, but he sucks anyways. He is a little bit better though than Marcus, so use him. So replace Marcus with him when you get when you get to him. Next up is Trek. Trek is a cavalier. You can see average stats, you know, well, pretty decent stats, I guess. Uh, however, his growth rate is also pretty shitty though. But you need Trek in order to Trek or Zealot to recruit Noah, the last the last uh, cavalier of the chapter. Noah's a good cavalier that you get this chapter. He's actually worth using. So to recruit uh Zealot, uh, I just had talked with Roy. Alright, level up. A while back, some unknown person was dying in the street. When I helped him, he gave him this sword. Really strange person, but nice. Hmm? Here's a sword. You can have it. Just take good care of it. And we get another killing edge. Mm-hmm, not important. Let me get the torch staff. Yay, love, love. Again, fucking shit. <sighs> Alright, this time I'm gonna put Marcus on the eastern side. And, uh. Switch from you. Yeah, okay, yeah, this will work. Let's try this one more time. 